Hi. Hi. We are the Baby Boomers. Yes, I'm Beth. I'm Cheryl. And we've been friends for 45 years. That's correct. We have been asked by Timeless to answer some questions. So we're going to do a Q&A for you. Mm -hmm. uh, the first question that was proposed to us mm -hmm. is, how old are you? I am 65. How old are you, Beth? I'm 65. Wow, hi, oh. Bobby. We're both 65. And how old do you both feel? How old do you feel, Cheryl? Um, let's see. <laughs> I feel 40. I sometimes feel 12, and then sometimes <laughs> I feel yeah, around 40. That was a good age. Good 40 age. Is it? Mentally. Mentally? 12, yes. Oh. <laughs> Depends on the day. And what age did you both decide to become content creators? When did we? We became content creators together. At age 63. Yes. And what made you want to start? We were on the Grammys and we backed up Da Baby, who's a rapper doing Rockstar. They had people of our age, correct? Mm -hmm. And Trevor Noah was the host and he said, this is Da Baby and Da Baby Boomers. So we jumped on TikTok the day after the Grammys. Right. And... We did Rockstar, the Rockstar Challenge. And the rest is history. And the, here, here we are. Uh, how did it feel when your first video went viral? How did it feel? <laughs> well, we were sitting, we had no idea what we were doing. That's the first thing. Zero. We were sitting here at this kitchen table and it started to go. And we were like, <laughs> I think we got the giggles. <laughs> I think we were laughing hysterically. What is this? And wasn't our family around too? I think so. I think we were having dinner. I think that they were so surprised. It's like, what in the hay? <laughs> so, um, yeah, we were shocked. Shocked. <laughs> in awe. Shock and awe. Shocked and in awe and <laughs> laughing and saying, what is this app? And yeah. here we are. And here we are. Um, how has it been since starting as a content creator? Oh, it's been great. It's been yes. fun. Lots of work. Because we don't live together. No. So we have to make time to mm -hmm. do it. And how do you feel about the uh, community? The I community. love the TikTok community. They have a big heart. I feel that we're all friends. Mm -hmm. It's uh, You can connect very easily. Mm -hmm. What do you feel? Yeah, I think, you know, we've, mm -hmm. we've learned a lot. That's for sure. But we love our TikTok community. Mm -hmm. They all have supported us and have been really open and, we love and them. welcoming. That's right. Mm -hmm. What did you both think of your current age when you were younger? What did you think of a 65-year-old when you were 12? <laughs> <laughs> um, I thought they were old. <laughs> I didn't think they were that old because I had a grandmother that lived to be 101. Wow. So I kept thinking like 90 is getting old. I just enough. never thought I'd be 65. No, whoever thinks that. But I'm glad we are. Yeah, I am. Uh, do you feel like you were completely wrong? Hmm. Maybe. Well, I don't know. My mom was always really fun. Even, you know, she was very lively. Mm -hmm. 65. She was 65. partying at. Yeah. So maybe I'll, I'll take that back. I, yeah. You know, I thought people were party animals. I did. Yeah. They were partying and uh, mm -hmm. carrying on and running around <laughs> the house. <laughs> what was streaking? It was back in the day of streaking. <laughs> Who was streaking? People that would come to our house for parties. I was in high school. Yes. So oh. a little side note. I yeah. Never, I don't know that one. So no, we were completely wrong. No. No. Have you both always loved dancing? Yes. Yes. Have you loved dancing? I started at age two and a half and you started at She came out of the womb. I came out of the womb tapping her, bubble change, bubble change, bubble change. A, a tap dancer. Yes. Uh, teacher. <laughs> uh, I, I probably started around five. Five. All right. Is there something that you would like to try to learn how to do now? Hmm. Cook. <laughs> That would be a good cook. thing for Why you. Why don't you teach me how to cook? I would love to teach well, you Let's have something. cooking lessons with Beth. I would love that, and I would love a, to learn a language, either mm, Italian or French. And I know French a little bit more than Italian, and I've always wanted to paint. Mm. Like Kelly. Yes, you yeah, should Like paint. my son. Mm -hmm. You teach me to cook, and we'll paint. And... Uh -huh. Maybe we can take a painting class uh. together. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, uh, let's see. What is the biggest difficulty you find as a content creator? I think finding time sometimes to be together. I think that, because a lot of people that do it just singly can do it any time, day or night. We have to get on the phone. What time can you be here? 
Bring your clothes. Where are we going to meet? Are you, she teaches all I the time. I teach, dance. Yeah, and I think the other thing that might apply to uh, people of a certain age is also uh, figuring everything out. Mm -hmm. You know, True. we're getting to the point where we're actually going to hire somebody, but that might not be to our best brain ability if we do. But, right. however, that, that might be good. What do you both do to maintain your health and energy as you get older? Work out. I feel working out is really important. We work out, we eat well, mm -hmm. we think about, you know, being vital and and being busy and doing stuff that we love to do. Um, yeah, we get up every day and we're both pretty positive people. We are. <laughs> Shoot. And right here it says you both are so energetic and fun. Thank you. And that's Fooled not you. something easy no. to maintain for a lot of people. Oh, yeah, that's, well, that's it is true. true. You it's do have to eat well, drink a lot of water. A lot of water. Really? Mine, mine doesn't look like water, but it is. No, it is. Do you have any advice for someone who is playing with the idea of becoming a content creator over 50 years old? Yes, do it. Do it. Just jump right in. Yeah, Don't do it. Don't be afraid. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Just post. Say How yes. How would they go about starting? Do your first video. <laughs> yeah. Choose something that you love. Right. If you're a painter... Paint something and talk about how you're doing it. And if you're a cook, do a cooking show. A lot of people, I'm learning. That's why people. I want to cook because I'm learning more things on TikTok too. A lot of people just set up the thing and, mm -hmm. and start cooking and talking while they cook and then they post. And do lives. I think lives are fun. I mean, not everybody likes to do lives, but I think that's another way to kind of get talk your community. Talk to your community. That's yeah. right. That's right. But just, you know, take pictures of your grandkids, you know, and put those up. Um, take pictures of flowers or whatever you may love. Uh, some people do travel. travel. Yeah, yes. when they go on a, on a big, tra you know, they go to Just write about it. Country. It doesn't have to be long and lengthy. But um, mm -hmm. take some pictures, put them up, and write. Instagram, TikTok, Facebook. A lot of people our age are on Facebook. They are. Mm -hmm. But venture over to the Instagram and the TikTok. That's correct. Well, okay. thank you, Timeless. Yes, thank you so much. This was great. All right, follow us at the Baby Boomers on Instagram, TikTok, and we also are on Facebook. And we have a YouTube channel. <gasps> Beth and Cheryl, the <laughs> Baby Boomers. Bye. Okay, bye.